<clears throat> hey everyone and welcome back to Immortals Phoenix Rising. On this video, we're doing the quest, Churned On. And this is a quest over in the Forge Lands. Right there. The major source of power for a fiery forge is revolving water wheels, but the wheels have been stopped by Typhon. Prometheus, methinks you are spinning your wheels a bit in this story. Z. So our objective, unblock the water wheels, and there's three of them. So we'll track that. And we'll go ahead and fast travel over to the big liar. And then we'll hit up that fresco challenge. We'll do the two chests. That chest, we'll take down the wraith. And uh, also we'll do that vault. I think there's some other stuff over there I haven't revealed yet. So anyways, we'll figure it out as we go. Fast travel. Okay, back in the forge lands. And this away. All right, so our fresco challenge is down there. And actually that chest may be up here a little bit higher. Yeah, I think that chest is right over here. So let's get the chest first. Oh, I just burned through all my stamina. I wasn't paying attention, but I think I can still get up here. Yep, no problem. Alright, here's the chest. And ingredients. Alright, so what are we dealing with down there? Well, we got a big boy. Big Cerberus thing. Or, that's a Chimera, actually. Invisible! Oh, too slow. They saw me. Oh, get out of the way, those flames! Oh, crap. I'm getting beat up. Alright, here we go. Boom! Oh, take out this guy. Alright, got him. Big hit and the stun on the Chimera. Hammer! We got all of them low. Just gotta finish them off. Gotcha. Alright, started out badly, but we finished it well. Oh, and you can see this is a challenge for the uh, one of the Daedalus challenges, I guess we'll call them. So after this one, only one left. Okay, past the Typhon Corruption, we have a chest. And more ingredients. Good. I'll use a couple of pomegranates, get my health a little bit higher. Alright, now for this fresco challenge. Just gonna break into here. Uh, let's see. I think up here is where we go. Yeah, up here. So stand on this, we'll bring that block down. Then you're gonna bring that block about right there. Come inside, be past the lasers, uh, the laser shooter thingies here. And then just pull it into the wall and drop. Good, lasers will turn on, but we're on this side and flip the switch. Now, how to arrange it. All right, let's do this. Push that that way. And there. Okay, rotate it one more time. Push this one into the corner. Get that up top, and then we just push both stacks over. Perfect.
poor Daedalus. All right, so just one more, and then we can figure out whatever the uh, finale is to this. All right, so I don't know if I've revealed that Ambrosia. I have not, so reveal that. And I know there's some other things I haven't revealed as well. Let's see, we got something over there. It's a vault. And we didn't reveal that Ambrosia. That might actually be it. So just the Ambrosias we've been missing. Uh, let's go get that Ambrosia over there. And then after that, we'll do the uh, Wraith Lair. That'll be our final Wraith, Odysseus. Oh, and is Typhon attacking? Oh, never mind. The music changed, I thought it was Typhon. Alright, got that Ambrosia. Good, good. And let's go do the Wraith Lair down here. Odysseus, corrupted hero. All right, we got some puzzles before we get to them. So what do we got here? We got a big block and a smaller one. So push that right up to the wall. Grab this, and you can jump over the lasers if you don't screw up like I just did. There we go. And then plop that down. Good. Uh, why didn't that work? All oh, right, because I still have to push this one over like so. All right, now we're good. Okay, so this one's a little bit trickier. So we got those itty bitty boxes. A regular size box, or I guess a medium size, and this huge block, which we haven't seen anything this big before. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna come over here, take itty bitty block, you can do a double jump with these, which means you can get over the laser beams. Good, plop that down there. Now we're gonna go to our big block and break it into two, and then we can move these. So push this over, I need to not crush the box, I don't know if that's possible. Anyways, it's close now and I can jump over the beam. Put that down, and then we just push our two blocks onto the two remaining pressure pads. Like so. And like so. Okay, fantastic. So if we're missing any health, we can get it there, but we're full. Let's go fight Odysseus. Right, here we go, power potion activated. Oh, you're gonna throw your stuff at me, huh? Well, it worked pretty well, actually. Defense potion up. Oh, dodged him. Oh, he got me there. Oh, crap. All right, kept my combo at least. Let me try to stun him. And some pretty good stun there. Try hammer. Right, you know what, can I get him here? Got him. And that might just be the end of them. I've already got a huge combo doing massive damage. Charge this up. Boom! Oh, I didn't quite get him, but he's close. Oh, he got me. Oh, he ruined my combo, but whatever. It's 
pretty much lights out for him anyway. Oh god, he got me. Right, you know what? You're rude, Odysseus. Got him. Thanks to Phoenix, Odysseus' days of wandering lost had finally come to an end. And that got us the trophy last hero standing. We defeated all race in their lairs. Sweet. And we got a new quest, legendary or bust. Oh, and while we're down here, there's a purple crystal. I definitely want that. Uh, next we will go get the chest up there. So, at least two harpies. I see some ground troops. Shield guy. Another shield guy. Alright, anyways, just gonna go up to the harpies and beat them up. Put the beat down on him. He couldn't even get his shield up. Right, I think that's it. Yep. All right. So we're gonna pretend that we don't have the uh, what's it called? Heracles strength. I think. If you have the strength ability, just pull the big block over to here. Plop it down. You'll get your chest. But I'll show you how to do it without. So put the little block there, and then we're gonna push this big block all the way up. Oh, actually, a little block's in the way a little bit. Let me push little block over. There, and then slide to the side, good. All right, so big old block coming in. Push him right, well, a little bit that way. All right, I need little block again. Plop little block right there. All right, big block right into there, perfect. All right, now another big block. Gonna push him, let's actually push him over just a little bit. And then push him across. Good. Get him to that back wall. All right now, back to this big block. Push it out. And push it over here. Up against the wall, good. And all the way back. Perfect. All right, then we just slide this all the way over to the pressure pad. Perfect. Okay, new visual, new Olympian's robe of judgment. That would be this one. Be fair to all you meet, lest they be the one to pass judgment later. Okay, and then we've got a vault down here. That's our next objective. Got a chimera over there. Let me uh, deal with shield boy. Dang it. Stunned him. Good. 
get over to that harpy. There we go. We already got a big combo going for Mr. Chimera. Almost stunned it. One more. There we go. Alright, stunned it up. That's going to be some massive damage. Charge up the hammer. Oh. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Alright, cleared those out easy, and in we go. The Torment of Icarus. Okay, so... Hit that, that'll spawn the, the ball, and then we roll it over that uh, stone creature thing. Let's put the ball right here. Go to the other side. All right, now pull it across. Good. Then just plop it down right here. Let it sort of stabilize and then flip the switch. Smash it over there and into the slot. Oh, and I didn't reveal the uh, chest. I should do that. Chest is over there. All right. So here, we'll go down below. Pull the ball over. Good. Pull it here. Wait, good, now pull it here. All right, then go up, bring it up. Good, and then, okay, yeah, then we bring it here. Flip the switch, it'll fly up, and then get punched. Oh crap, no! <laughs> Oh my god, that's never happened before. I don't know why that was off course, but that sucks. I gotta drag it all the way through again. Alright, so apparently you gotta be a little careful on that. Oh, lap. Crap. Got scared by falling there. Um, but yeah, apparently you get. What? Why aren't you grabbing? Alright. Try it again. Grab it. Okay, there we go. Much better. And then you stop. Anyways, let's grab this quickly. Ow. Okay. Up we go. Bring the ball up. Put it into the slot, and then let's make sure it's, like, perfectly aligned. That looks good. Hit the switch. There we go. Much better. And it didn't fall into the slot. Give it a little bit of help. All right, now before we move on, let's go get our chest. So to get our chest, we'll need to backtrack a little bit. Go up here. Here, get your stamina back and then be ready to jump quickly. So pull this. Up we go. Alright, and then over. Okay, new gear, Helm of the Ethereal Automaton. Plus 28% damage with Hephaestus' hammer, and creates two stamina orbs on hit with Hephaestus' hammer. Okay, new helmet for us. All right, now we can just glide back on over where we were. And continue this vault. All right, so this one's on fire, so dragging it with our hands is uh, ill-advised. Just drag it over here. Let it hit that back wall. Good, don't let it fall, though. Okay, drag it this way. 
Same thing, let it hit that back wall, that's fine. And, uh, let's see, we'll make sure we time this right. Alright, grab it. Here we go. Oh, I'm meant to keep dragging it. There we go. Alright, ah, crap. No, don't grab it like that, that's a bad idea. Alright, um... Actually, you know, I'm just gonna risk the damage. It's not that big of a deal. Just take that little bit of damage, get that right in the correct spot. Flip the switch. Boom, hit it into that wall, and then hit it over there. And into the slot, perfect. All right, sweet. That'll get us to the exit. Another vault closed. Let's go for that Ambrosia next up there. Oh, and there's something I did not reveal. Chest down there. Anything else? Nope, that appears to be it. Okay. So anyways, uh, Ambrosia. You can see there's some streams that'll... Airstreams that'll help me get up there. We'll utilize those over here. As Phoenix explored Hephaestus' ancient forge, she discovered its most important component, the water wheels. Why does a forge need water? Look, Zeus, I do futures. That's my thing, not forges. We're gonna have to clear these guys out. This dude's just chilling. Take that! Oh, a little ninja dude jumped in at the wrong time. I finished him off, good. Oh, climbing, don't climb. Wait, you want some of this, buddy? Take that! Want some of this bird? Take a freeze. Line it up. Boom. Okay, up we go. We could go over to those streams. I guess we will. Might be faster than climbing. Actually, I think I could have climbed faster, but whatever. Okay, Ambrosia! Back up to six. Alright, so over here, what we need to do is clear the water wheels, but that's way over here. I need to fight that dude. All right, so you can see this one's all clogged up with corruption. I'm going visible. Hello, take that. Charged up that big hit, good. Try 
trying to get him stunned and... Oh, couldn't get it. Oh, come on. There we go. Finish him with style. Goodbye. Okay. Let's clear off this corruption. of the water wheels caused it to lurch back to life. All right, now there's another one right below. All right, so two of the three water wheels are freed. The third one's over there. And I don't think I revealed that ambrosia. No, I actually did. Okay. Uh, so we'll get that ambrosia, then we'll clear the water wheel. Oh, and there's something over there. Vault of Tartarus. Anything else? Nope. Okay. So take this up. Oh, and there's a crystal over there. It looks yellow. Yeah, yellow. Alright, well, yellow's not terrible. Would prefer red. I'll take it yellow. Okay, so we'll take these up to the Ambrosia. We don't need to fight him. We'll see if we can avoid him. Hey, we actually did. Alright, climb up the rest of the way. And I'll take that pomegranate. Ambrosia! Back up to seven. Let me just get my stamina back and then we'll go get that last water wheel cleared up. Alright, surprise attack on the harpies. Here we go! Easy. All right, get this crap out of here. Nope, can't hit it. <laughs> the heck is going on? Uh, what the heck? I'm stuck. All right, whatever. Use the stamina potion just to be careful. With the water gushing like torrents of rain, Phoenix was one step closer to freeing the forge from Typhon's grip. Little did Phoenix know, however, that the worst was yet to come. Okay, our quest is completed. Churned on. Well, we still got a lot to do before the forge is free, like he said. But anyways, we're done for now. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.